ain't post to Watch out for the people that ain't close to Speak a little something you can toast to I ain't tryna hear about what you won't do Hey fairies and welcome back to my channel. It's Loretta Andrea. So in today's video, I'm going to be cutting, bleaching, and dyeing my hair on camera for you guys. And this is all going to be done on my short hair. I've bleached my hair about a couple times already on my channel. I have videos back to back of my whole entire bleach process. And just like any other how-to video, I will have a table of contents for you guys to check out for those that just want to hop around and jump around in the video. So I went to Detroit about two weeks ago and got my hair cut this is actually Chooch Cuts he's out in Detroit and I will leave all of his information down below but I just checked him out got my hair cut because my hair was looking a hot ass mess I felt like my hair was looking real cute because I love the color but y'all saw the back of my head was just doing its own thing and I finally just wanted to get that thing tamed so he just gave me pretty much a simple fade I did ask for a little design in the back, but that didn't even matter because it ended up growing out anyway. Now, I kind of knew that while he was cutting my hair, I was most likely going to have to re-bleach my hair, but I didn't know I had to re-bleach it as much as I did. I was just gonna do like a few patchy areas that I thought was gonna be patchy, but I was like, oh girl, my entire roots are pretty much black, so I'm about to just hope for the best and just re-bleach my hair, and let's just cross our fingers, it don't fall out. I'm gonna let you guys know all the products that I use down below but it's pretty much the same routine that I did in my first bleaching video if you guys don't know what video I'm talking about make sure you guys go and check that out because it is the simplest healthiest way to bleach your hair after I have my bleach mixture all mixed up I'm gonna take this step one absolute booster from ion this is seen as a dupe of Olaplex I know the word Olaplex is very sensitive to some peeps I'm not saying it is exactly like Olaplex but from what the reviews say when people say about it is definitely closest to it I'm also going to take this ion sensitive scalp protector and apply that to my scalp before I put in my cream bleach mixture I'm kind of just trying to take the extra precautions as much as possible because my hair is already lightened it's not extremely lightened because he definitely cut off a lot of my ends which is really not a bad thing but I'm just very nervous that my hair was going to fall out at least on the pre-bleach parts but luckily that did not end up happening and I believe it's because I use the ion absolute step one and step two but I'm just gonna let this mixture sit on for 30 minutes and then I will tell you guys what I used after I rinsed it out <laughs> So this is the step two to the absolute perfect and this is the color sealer. You're supposed to rinse out the bleach and then put the color sealer on your hair. Let that sit for about 30 minutes and then move on to shampoo and condition. I already knew I was gonna be doing a, another bleaching process with the Age Beautiful Cream Bleach. You can leave that mixture on for about 60 minutes but I prefer to just do it in two intervals of 30 minutes because I just wanna make sure that my hair is not getting over Really dried out and it's just going to be as healthy as possible so I'm going to put that same cream bleach on my hair for a second time and then just let that sit for an additional 30 minutes now this is the reason that my blonde is so healthy looking and full it doesn't look thin and it just looks absolutely beautiful this is the best my hair has ever looked with my bleach hair and I'm going to tell you guys exactly why I've been using this Olaplex for about a month and a half now and I find Finally decided to do it on camera and this is the Olaplex number zero bonding treatment I'm going to apply this to my hair and just really massage this in from roots to end and let this sit for about 10 minutes <laughs> 
Without rinsing your hair, you want to apply the number three hair protector bonding treatment right over top. You just wanna take a little bit of this and just really massage that through your hair. And I'm going to use some clean wrap as an added moisturizing treatment. And I really honestly feel like my hair is as soft and as conditioned as it is because I put the saran wrap on. And I'm gonna put an aluminum cap over top of that and let it sit for another 30 minutes. This is how my hair looks after I did my bonding treatment and it's just so nice and soft and silky. And now I'm going to follow up by using the Olaplex number no. four maintenance shampoo. Before you use the hair colors that I'm gonna be showing you guys in the video, they say to shampoo your hair beforehand. So it just ended up working out perfectly that I did my bonding treatment and then shampooed and now moving on to color. So now we are to the mixing portion of the video and I'm gonna be showing you guys every single color that I use as well as the ratios of how much to use per hair color. I ended up mixing about four different colors from light gray, dark gray, a neon yellow, as well as a yellow green. It's so crazy how I ended up coming up with the galaxy color that you guys saw in the beginning of the video. But these are literally all the colors that I mixed together to create my masterpiece. I also end up showing you guys what the colors look like on a paper towel just to give you guys an extra visual of exactly what the colors really look like. Aye, aye. Look. I'm too cool for the rules, baby, get off of me. Never need no push, I do it all for me. Keep a couple real hitters, got them on call for me. Money moving, got it in the market where it ought to be. Too true for the flex, baby, don't cap to me. Drop 50, bring 150 right back to me. Keep a couple real hitters, got them on call for me. Money moving, got it in the market where it ought to be. Look, Papa don't preach, teachers don't teach, gon' reach, that's facts. I ain't worried about none of that. I'm making that cash day. Bunch of O's like NASCAR, but it's really more like NASDAQ. Why they thinking that they hot when they really more like Quota on me like a So now we're moving on to coloring my hair. And this is what my hair looks like air dried. You're supposed to apply all these hair colors to super dry hair. So I'm first gonna start with the dark blue gray color. And it ended up being a lot darker than I kind of wanted it to. But I'm really not complaining because I feel like the ending results came out marvelous. So I just take that dark blue gray color and just apply that to my temple area as well as the nape of my head and now I'm going to take this neon yellow and apply that directly to the center top of my hair and then I'm going to take this light gray color and apply it right over top of that blue gray and then gradually start to blend that upward because that's going to be our mixing color that's going to gradient all the colors together. Lastly, I'm gonna take that yellow green color and apply that directly in between the neon yellow and the gray color. And then I'm just gonna take my time just applying all four of the colors, just blending them all together because I wanted my hair to be as saturated as possible, especially because we're using neon colors. And then once I have all the colors applied, I just start to massage it in with my brushes and then move on to doing my brows. Paper on it like I'm loose leafing, buying them assets. Build me a cash net, I could fall in. Look at my last bit, ain't got a tiptoe, I'm all in. Think on a level that can't fail, and I roll me a J with the hate mail. Been doing good on the merch sale, all this bread on me look like a bake sale. Tell her what's really good, I'll be really good on a jaw jack. Send an email about the bread, I'ma hit you back with the call back. So just like I did with the bonding Olaplex treatment, I'm gonna do the same thing to my hair color and just apply some clean wrap to my hair. This is gonna add as a extra conditioning step to my hair color. 
colors. I'm using Arctic Fox. It is extremely conditioning to the hair. I actually ended up leaving this on for about five hours. It does not matter how long you leave this Arctic Fox hair color on because the longer you leave it on, actually the more conditioned your hair will be. And then I'm also gonna take some heat to my hair for about 15 minutes. It just adds to the conditioning part of the hair color. So why I need you? Big flex, my swole, double cup and I'm pulled up. So this is about five hours later. I didn't purposely want to leave it on for five hours. It just ended up being that that was the time that I rinsed it out from phone calls, meetings, and all that, you know, YouTube stuff. So I just took the clean wrap off and this is how the gradient was looking. I was just like, how did we get here, y'all? The top from the neon yellow just is so bright. I was extremely happy with it and I just started to comb out the color because I was just so anxious and impatient and I kind of felt like as I started combing it out it looked like a Van Gogh painting. All hill figures and I ain't even got a deal with you. If I ain't never split a bill with you. I got Hennessy and Hort Chata. Baby girl wearing Nada. Growing from a cider, uh -huh. bad robe in his Prada, okay. Fiji water by the cold glass, granddaddy by the zip. This is what my hair looks like without any product. This is probably about three days after I rinsed my hair out. And I can't even describe how we even got here with this color by only using gray and neon yellow. Like, how sis? I feel like the little bit of gray is peeking through, making it look like light is shining on my hair every single time I move my head. And it's just honestly just so beautiful. So I'm just going to be styling my hair with a few products. I'm gonna take some JBCO water and just saturate my hair with that. Like me, they be all in my wood tip, not a stain on my white. I'm then gonna take this Olaplex number no. seven bonding oil. And I am obsessed with this oil, you guys. It is so bomb. It does a really good job with moisturizing my hair, but does not leave my hair super oily. And I'm just gonna steal in all the hydration with this TGIN Honey Whip Hydrating Mousse. I've been using this for forever to lay my curls down, and it makes my curls lay down for like days. My grind, so why I need you? Baby girl, love my bob, and I like me too. No roof on my top, and my babe see through. On the pen, don't stop, they ain't gon' feed you. I've been all on my grind, so why I need you? So that is pretty much the end of the video, you guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed this. I would love to continue to do this with different colors. I literally only use two colors from a different family and I created a gradient masterpiece. Let me know if you guys would want me to continue something like this by just taking two colors to create different gradient effects. As always, I love you guys so much. Make sure you guys like this video subscribe to my channel and turn on that notification bell as always i love you guys bye